nature is that there tends to be a lot of puddles as we see a big off for Ryan Hunter Ray. Bottom of the hill in turn three, coming up to turn four. Man, I wonder if that's a little bit similar to what happened in, in session one for uh, for Alexander Rossi. And oh, big crash there for uh, Rene Binder. Yep, 32 machine has found the tire wall. Uh, Rene Bender, that's down through 11 and 12. It looks like uh, he got off of the grass and bumped it into the tire barrier as the red flag comes out. I, I'm struggling to understand what's going on here. Usually you'll see the drivers adapt to the to the difficult conditions a little bit quicker, but, but here it's like they're all going out on the red tires and trying to push as hard as they possibly can and just completely underestimating how, how little grip there is and uh, and in the case of Rene Binder just a bit of a wiggle similar exact same spot actually as Alexander Rossi where he looped it in, in practice one and just Binder instead of spinning it actually corrected it but over corrected it same thing here for Ryan Hunter Ray bottom of the hill turn three just gets a little bit of a snap loose moment has to correct it and drives himself right off the track so this is tricky stuff is it just a, the comfort zone that they had established here with the previous incarnation of this chassis and uh, this is just such a radical change? Well, I would say yes, but Rene Binder has never been in this car or in the previous car on this track before, so this is a whole new experience for him. So um, I would say yes, but, but the answer to that is no. What it looks like to me is uh, these cars, once they get to, once they get to the limit,